So go ahead and write your description. Whether doing a lab or sitting among three, four, and five-year-olds. So to make 11, we already know we needed 10. Kathy Stilley and Shauna Liu say they've become better leaders. It's important for parents in the community to see that teachers aren't just delivering instruction in the classroom, that we're part of the environment, that we're part of the decision making that goes on in the school. Teachers are leaders, especially for their students and for other teachers. That teachers are leaders is the driving force behind the district's Teacher Leadership Academy. We have Thanksgiving, we have Christmas. Both Stilly and Lou are graduates of this professional development program, which just welcomed a brand new cohort. The end goal is to develop teachers into change agents who can not only better lead their students, but also step into leadership roles among their peers and in their school community. When we were developing this program, we were looking at what high-performing countries were doing successfully, and we wanted to replicate that in a way that um, not only recruited those teacher leaders, but retaining them through a cohorted uh, professional development, working together, collaborating together, only serves to improve student outcomes, school culture, retention within our profession. The program lasts over a two-year span with teachers in the same cohort meeting for 14 full days. Topics covered include leadership development and inquiry, as well as equity and equitable practices. Well, when I first heard about it, I thought it'd be a great opportunity you know, to get out of the classroom and learn some new skills, different ideas that can help me move up to the next level. The same reason we invest in our children, we invest in our teachers so that the growth, the learning, the education that we provide to students can continue to blossom. Participants must also conduct an action research project to implement at their schools. For those who have gone through the program, they say the lessons learned have proven valuable. And one of the things I looked at is my behavior and how it affects the behavior of the kids. One of the biggest things was communication. The activities that we did allowed you to listen to the other person and to actively listen to what they're saying. And for those going through it now, they're hopeful that in becoming better leaders, they'll shift their school's culture. I think it's a great way to elevate yourself so that you in turn can elevate others no matter what level you are at. I think all teachers should want to take away from this a way to build a better culture at their school because it starts with the culture. Once you build an environment where everyone is working together as a cohesive unit, then it trickles down to the kids. 